Good afternoon, friends in Vietnam. Thank you for joining our online live show in Vietnam Solar E Exhibition. This is Roger Bong Sham and my band New Energy Call Limited, your host for today. How are you guys doing there in Vietnam? Wish you all good. It is really a pity that we are not able to see each other face to face in the exhibition. However, it is great that we can talk and share ideas online. In order to help you better updated about our solar mounting structure, we have decided to present this to you. Our topic today is better return on investment. Solar PV floating tracker artificial mounting system. To get any further information about our products, you can contact us via email, Facebook, and LinkedIn, etc. And now please allow me to introduce the speaker of today, Michelle Chao, our Director for International Market. She's been working for more than 10 years in the solar industry. Before the flats are blocked by COVID-19, Michelle flew to more than 20 countries each year, attending more than 50 exhibitions and visiting hundreds of project sites. With rich experience in the solar products and the solar industry, let's enjoy her sharing now. Welcome, Michelle. Hello, hello, Michelle from My Bad Energy here. How are you? We miss you so much. I haven't went to Vietnam almost one year now because of the pandemic. And our company's full name is Xiamen My Bad New Energy. We are the manufacturer for tracker, solar floating system, and the bifacial ground mounting. Also, we have rooftop mounting system. So today, my topic is better ROI from our solar tracker solar PV floating system and the bifacial mounting. I will introduce the topic from the following five parts. Solar tracker, floating system, bifacial mounting, some basic data about my bad energy, and some typical project reference. First is about our solar tracking system. Market information. As from IHS research data, in the end of 2019, the capacity of uh, solar tracker have exceeded 31 gigawatt, up to 55% for the whole year installation of ground mount. And uh, most of the installations are in the countries like USA, Australia, Southern American countries like Brazil, Mexico, Chile, and also in Spain. And as we know, in Vietnam market, we have already have some uh, solar tracker project installed for the first phase of FIT. And also, like, as we know, like Chongnan, they have already invested a very large project with tracking system, which is around 500 megawatt in southern Vietnam. The types of Foundation available from our solar tracker. Um, we have four types PHC tube pile concrete foundation, H shaped pile foundation, C shaped pile foundation. So, for um, most uh, popular tracking system, is a horizontal single axis tracking system. Our design could be 1 plus N or 2 plus N, that means one row of solar module or two row of solar module. Suitable both for the bifacial solar module and the single side solar module and also double glass solar module. The main advantages of our solar, solar tracker is our first one is easy to cleaning without shading, highly pre-assembled and cost effective. The material available, steel, aluminum, and post-mac. Maximum can design with uh, 90 solar panels for each array. This is a kind of uh, typical design and the tracking angle is within the range of uh, plus or minus 60 degree and uh, the voltage uh, can achieve 
Cut 3 is 1,500 wattage or 1,000 wattage and it's self power supply. Our solar tracker is applicable to different kinds of ground for flat ground, slope ground and rugged ground. Different kinds of uh, ground. Different with uh, slope with, with uh, slope rugged ground or slightly rugged ground. And according to a demo project installed in Xiamen City, our city, the the capacity or the power output can be generated from the tracking system will be around 16% higher than the fixed structure. And as we know, different uh, con different countries, different latitude, the solar time is different. So in Vietnam, more thousand than Xiamen, I think the power can be more than 16. Typically, could be 20 to 30 percent higher than the fixed structure. Some uh, main mechanical parameter for our tracking system could be single row or double row and the solar panels power can reach to 600 watt now. Tracking range plus minus 60 degree. Tracking accuracy is minus plus one degree and the type of drives could be 7, 9, 12 inch applicable both for bifacial or single side solar modules. Something about our control system. The system is, uh, use, uses uh, GPS and the Beidou dual positioning system to automatically obtain the local latitude and longitude and the true solar time. By combining with astro astronomical Sorry, it's an uh, astronomical selling the calculation and NASA official website solar tracking data verification. It can achieve high precision solar trajectory tracking. The operation interface for our control system. All, the, all of the interface in language put, could be English or if you like to put to input Vietnamese, we can also input with the translation. The anti-shadow tracking technology. The specification, specification or the dimensions for our control system. It's very small, just around uh, um, 30 centimeters. And the, the self-powered wiring way. The schematic diagram of tracking method from morning to noon to afternoon then to evening. The installation way for the control system usually will be put at the back side of the structure and the solar modules. The control system performance parameters. It could be both wireless or wired. Wireless will be around uh, two kilometers point to point way and uh, for a while it can uh, it can support 800 meters distance and the working wind speed usually should be less or equal to 18 meters per second we have uh, both the and rock certificate for our control system tilt sensor and the C certificate for the whole control system. So second part I would like briefly introduce about the solar PV floating system, the development history of our floating system. We have uh, involved uh, in the research and design for solar PV floating system since the year 2014 and uh, as we know the whole industry for solar floating system is just from 2009 and we currently have uh, designed uh, six generations of product now from generation one to generation two generation three then generation four for s and g 4 n and uh, this year we have also have launched uh, our latest generation called 
Generation 5 C5. Some um, standards we follow by our floating system. IEC, GTS, and uh, the BS, BS, the British standard for marine standard calculation usually is using for the anchoring system calculation. Also the DMVGL, offshore design standard is applicated. So the main features for our floating system, the clearance from the solar module to the floater or to the surface of water can reach more than 300 millimeter. Most of our other competitors project, other competitors products in the market, available in the market is less than 200 millimeter. And the distance between the two Fixing points for the solar modules can reach more than 1,800 mm, which is com com compatible with most of the solar modules installation guides, solar modules manufacturers installation guides. And our ceiling point for the floaters, both for the walkway and for the main floaters, is at the uh, one point one one quarter to one third location to make the waterproof feature better. And we have the overlapping um, design feature for our walkway floaters to form the whole floating system as a full or as a connected, uh, connected uh, floating platform to make the strength better. So our, our solution is also suitable for double glass solar module without frame. Then we also have the adding function to add the fans outside the walkway to make the whole system more safe. And our design can, can design with the maximum solar module dimension to 2,350 mm by 1,150 mm, which is uh, suitable for most of the big solar modules in the market. For the layout, we also have the interval gapping walkway, walkway floater design to make the floating system custom more effective. And for the combined box or string inverter structure design, we have a, a portrait way and horizontal way. We also have the east-west or symmetrical design, to, um, which can achieve more installation capacity on the same area of the, of the water surface. And very suitable for low latitudes area. Uh, for Vietnam, like southern Vietnam, is quite suitable. And we have the big floater, big concrete floater to hold the centralized inverter or the transformers, which can, which is assured with 50-year life, suitable for large heavy objects of more than 20 tons. And the area is about 60 to 80 square meters. So summary of our floating products feature. So exact for a small number of fasteners and fixing fixtures, the overall structure of the floating system is all plastic HDPE, which is um, the anti-corrosion is quite better and suitable to put on the water. Yeah. In addition to the convention of 5 degrees and 10 degrees, the maximum inclination angle can be 15 degrees. The center of the side length of the floating system clamping component is more than one meter to ensure the stability and uh, to assure as less as possible of the micro cracks for the solar modules. So IO floating floaters 
adopts overlapping design and adopts the fixing method of the inner frame of the clamping component. After installation, the clearance between the lowest point from the solar module to the surface of the water is more than 300 mm. We have a lot of test reports for our floating system like the TUV, aging test, anti-UV test, wind tunnel test, and the drinkable water test from NSF, and also the anti-fire or anti-flame test from TOV. And we have the patents for our floating system, both domestic from China and also international patents. So, anchoring system design for our floating system, Usually, the anchoring system could be anchoring into the water or anchoring on shore. It depends on the uh, water area and the water features. The structure, the typical structure for the concrete block for our anchoring system. And the anchoring system ropes and the connectors. The anchoring ropes could be both um, steel rope or some uh, plastic rope or some um, flexible ropes. Anchoring system layout design for a 400 kilowatt project and a 7 megawatt project. Regular and irregular design, a 18 megawatt anchoring layout. A technical route for the floating pro products and the price roadmap as we can see from 2015 to 2020 the price almost uh, decreased around 60 to 70 percent the third part I would like to briefly introduce about the bi official solar mounting market from World Mac to 2024, the bifacial module capacity will exceed 21 gigawatt. And some typical bifacial solar module technology, the installation height of the bifacial module is recommended to be higher than one meter, and shading from bracket and junction box should be avoided. These two points are very important factor for us to consider how to select the correct bifacial solar mounting. According to one of the top three solar modules brand research, from different kinds of surfaces, the reflection of the light to the backside of solar module is different. Like on water, it's nearly 10%. On ground, on grass, soil, and concrete is different, around 25 to 40%. And on some reflective film or on snow field, it can reach 75 to 90%. And with some real installation projects from different countries, like from Saudi Arabia, from India, China, USA, both for fixed and tracking system, the power output can increase from 4.4% uh, to 20.6% for with the bifacial solar module comparing with a fixed uh, structure. And uh, according to another research by another top three solar module brand in uh, Middle China, also on different kinds of uh, surfaces, the power output can be generated the higher percentage is also different from 5% to 90% on different surfaces. And according to the research results, we can see the bifacial solar module can generate longer times than the standard single side solar module. Our MyBed bifacial ground mounting system we typically have two types of uh, bifacial ground mounting. Uh, first one is the PGT2, which is a 
single RAMIN pile solution suitable for large-scale projects like the second FIT, we still have a lot of uh, 50 megawatt, 100 megawatt, even to 300 megawatt projects in Vietnam. To consider using the RAMIN piles for the large-scale solar projects can it can save a lot of uh, installation time. And uh, the main features of the structure design, we need to firstly consider enough uh, ground clearance to, resist, to withstand the high wind, wind load or medium wind load of the open field of the uh, large scale solar projects. And uh, secondly, should uh, consider to avoid any possible sh shading at the backside of the solar module. So the technical parameter for our PDD2, it can achieve a tilt angle from a 0 to 60 degree and the wind load ma maximally can withstand 60 meters per second. Material could be, all, uh, could be aluminum combined with a steel ramming pile or all steel structure. Warranty is 10 years. And the second solution is PDT4, which is a two-posture design, could be combined with a ground screw or concrete foundation. This, this solution is both suitable for the large-scale project installation and also suitable for the medium-scale project installation. All the structural components could be pre-assembled in our factory and, uh, and it can save a lot of installation time on site. So to have all the project designed, first, I mean for all the projects like the solar tracker, the solar PV floating system or bifacial solar project, we have our checklist form. If you would like to check our products to know more how to um, select the suitable solutions for your projects, you can come to my bed to ask for the project checklist form to fill with. So my bed energy have supplied more than six gigawatt of uh, solar mounting globally till the end of 2019 and our annual production capacity is more than 2 gigawatt. We have supplied more than 2,000 projects globally ranking top 10 brand for the mounting system and we have more than 20 global or international certificates, more than 50 domestic and international patents for our products. Our products have exported to more than 100 countries and regions. The main history of our company. And there's the typical test machines for us, our products. Our main market. We have a lot of uh, uh, involvement in the southern, in the southern Asia or Southeast Asian countries, the Asian countries. For Vietnam, we have uh, supplied more than 150 ground mounting and uh, more than 100 rooftop mounting till the end of uh, 2019. And uh, till this quarter, quarter three, um, till the end of quarter three, we have already supplied more than 80 megawatt of rooftop mounting to Vietnam market. We also have uh, started some uh, involvement of the solar tracker and the floating system for Vietnam market. Last part is uh, some uh, typical project reference from uh, my bed. The floating projects installed in China and Thailand. Some more in Thailand and China. Ground mountains supplied to Australia, Cambodia and Japan. And in southern Vietnam, um, a project called Daibak, we have supplied 
uh, in the first uh, quarter of uh, 2019, which is uh, totally around uh, 120 megawatt. And we also have uh, installed uh, or supplied uh, a lot more big projects in China and other countries. So exact uh, the ground mounting, we also have uh, the car port suitable for commercial and industrial use. And rooftop projects, we have supplied a lot to Vietnam, Thailand, Philippines, the Asian countries, and also in China, to Singapore, and uh, to Spain. Malaysia. Okay, that's all about my uh, introduction for today's topic. Wow, thank you, Michelle. What, a, what an impressive sharing. I think it's going to be very useful for our Vietnamese clients. And during your presentation, I collected some questions from the viewers, and I would like to have your answers for that. Okay. Sure. Yeah. And the first question comes from Ms. Tao, and she's asking uh, if we send the project information to MapIt Energy, so how long can we expect to receive the design solution? And what is the lead time and delivery time? Okay, a very great question. Uh, usually it will take two to three working days for our engineer team to finish the design uh, after we finish collecting the project data from our customers and uh, a very, very good advantage to cooperating uh, from a Vietnamese company with Chinese company is the distance. As we know from Xiamen Airport to Ho Chi Minh uh, City's port, it only takes three days on the sea. So the delivery time will be very quickly and usually our lead time uh, the production time for our regular products is around uh, one to two weeks. Okay, thank you for your answer. And the second question comes from Mr. Heng. And he's asking, we are a new company engaged yes. in solar installation. And does MapIt Energy provide uh, installation guide or video? Yes, um, most of our uh, ready solutions we have uh, ready installation guides and videos for our customers and partners to uh, refer to, 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 to refer with. And uh, for some, uh, so most of the rooftop and the ground solutions, we also have tracking uh, records. That means we have a ready project installed from uh, southern Vietnam to northern Vietnam. If any of our customers interested to visit our project site, we can also uh, arrange. Okay, thank you again for your wonderful sharing and explanation. Okay, great. Thank you. Time flies. It's the end of the, this presentation. We really appreciate the valuable time you spend with us, and we do hope that you get something away from this presentation. In case you need any information about our solar mounting structure or our project references in Vietnam, please do not hesitate to send your inquiry to our email, Facebook, and LinkedIn, etc. We look forward to seeing you in next year's solar exhibition. That's it for today. Bye for now.